Hi, my name is Jay Kripnip, and in this video I'm going to show you how to chop up the drum samples and lay them out on the pads. So the first one we have is the whole drum loop itself. And in order to do it, we need to use the mark button. So mark is going to set a cue point wherever you want to start the beat. So right now we have the bass drum. Now we have our clap. And a little shaker. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start chopping them up and using copy and putting them on the first four pads. So I'm going to have a drum, I mean, sorry, I'm going to have a kick drum, I'm going to have a snare, hi-hat, and a shaker. So the procedure I use to start chopping my drums is I hit shift and copy, and that'll take whatever drum loop I have, and I'm going to just lay it down in two sections. So I'll copy, so shift, one, copy the drum loop, and then I'm going to paste it over here. Hit record, record is the enter. So now I have it here and here. So I'm gonna do that for each one. So on the last one, I'm gonna do the same thing over again. So I'm gonna hit shift, pad one to copy, the pad I want and where I wanna put it. So right now I have one, two, three, four, and six that have the same exact drum loop. So now we're gonna start chopping up the drum break. So I want my kick right here, and then I want the snap or the clap on the second one. So I'm gonna hit mark as soon as I know it's coming up. So, so right here we have it and we'll fine tune it. So we'll hit the start and end level and we're just going to bring it back just a touch. So using control knob one is going to bring me. So now we have the full clap. So we have kick, the clap. So on pad three, we're going to do the hi-hat. And then on four, we'll do that little roll. The dit -dit -dit. And then we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna bring it back just a touch. So we're on four, hit start. And then we're gonna bring it back just a little bit. And then right here, it'll show mark on each one. So we don't want the whole sample. So we're gonna start truncating stuff. So on pad two, I have the clap. And we're gonna go ahead and hit delete mark and it's going to truncate the kick and we're going to do the same throughout the the rest of the pad so on pad three we're going to do the same thing we're going to hit delete mark and it'll say trc truncate and on four as well and so now we have our drum samples